Hello friends, welcome to Amazon Webcast and in today's video demonstration we are going to see how to enable the code mode control panel in Windows 10. Windows 10 has a vast amount of settings that can be configured to adjust how Windows operate. However, adjusting these settings is not the easiest things to do. The majority of them must be adjusted using the control panel or you can also use the new settings application. So this is the first one. From where we can manage our Windows 10 computer and the second one is the control panel. Although the control panel is good tool, it can sometimes be difficult to use. For the most part, when using control panel, you must toggle back and forth between numbers of different windows to set up everything. Sometimes it's also hard to find specific settings that actually you are looking for. There is another way that you can adjust settings on your Windows computer which gives you all adjustment options in one place that is code mode or the master control panel. I am not sure why it is called a code mode because it's basically just a list of all the possible settings in one place and you don't have to name it a code mode. To get this master control panel you need to first create a new folder on your desktop and then you have to rename with something specific. So let's minimize the uh, setting apps and control panels. Let's create a new folder by right click on it and select new and then select new folder. Now you have to rename this folder with particular code. Now already I copy the name of this folder. Let's copy this. Close and let's rename this folder by right click on it and select rename and the paste the code which we copied earlier from the notepad file and then hit enter. Now you can see the icon of this folder is changed to just like uh, similar to control panel. And remember you can change that beginning text to anything you like. It doesn't have to be a code mode. And so if you want to specify another name that time you can specify the another name rather than code mode. Now double click on the icon to open it up. You will notice that it looks similar to control panel windows with all the options placed in a list format. This is a great way to see all the available adjustment for windows in a one spot. Now you can jump to a certain settings and configure it easily without having to go through the bunch of different windows on control panel. When you click on listing within the code mode windows you will able to go straight to the configuration page like for example let's click on create and format hard disk partition it is actually a part of administrator tools. If you click on it it will open a disk management console. And that's it. As you can see, the disk management snap-in console is open up. Click on close. Remember that everything in a master control panel can also be found in a regular control panel by performing a search or you can toggle between the menus over there. Let's open a control panel and uh, let's switch the category to large icons. Now as you can see, all these lists are the part of application name administrator tools. Now here. All these three menus are part of the autoplay application. Now if you see and click on autoplay, here we can see the menus over there. But in a code mode, it will be look like different. Like we have changed default settings for media and devices. If you click double click on it, it will open the same menu. It's just similar to the control panel. So as you can see, the both results are similar. So the main convenience of code mode is that you can see all the settings without having to know what to search for. This has proved helpful on a number of occasions because I didn't know exactly what word to search for but I was able to find the settings when browsing through the list in code mode. Again this little trick works on Windows 7, Windows 8.1 and Windows 10. Hope this video will helpful for you. That's it for this video demonstrations. Thanks for watching this video.